Have you ever had to move your entire flock two and a half hours away? Well, we do. Uh, um, things have kind of slowed a little bit around here and I can't be here as often, but there's also a much bigger reason why. We'll get to that in a couple of days, but it's exciting news, at least for us, and it's just gonna be another chapter in our, in our great adventure. Anyway, bam, one of these guys just laid. So uh, yeah, the guys around here will be pretty happy about that, especially a little boy named Harvey who's really looking forward to uh, seeing what these chickens are gonna do. Anyway, I gotta get this tractor tidied up. William's coming in the morning to come get it and take it home. Uh, we're, we're not working quite so many hours around here, um, still more than 40, but anyhow, it just makes better sense to bring it home because it'll be easier to manage. We're gonna load this thing up in the morning and then we're gonna have even more exciting news in the coming days, so uh, stay tuned for that. All right, so right now I am headed over to get the chickens for my dad's job site. Um, I think I just drove through Paris, and I've got, I think, about 50 more minutes, and then I'll be there, and then we'll bring the chickens home. And now I think there's a cop behind me, so wish me luck. All right, it's moving day. You very seldom get to see me and William on the camera at the same time, but here we are. Um, we're gonna get them loaded up in this little dump trailer we have back here and uh, get them to the house. And like I said, there'll be some good, um, exciting news to come. So without further ado, we're gonna get this party started. We gotta get it done before these guys get out of here for break. So you can see behind me that the chickens are loaded up and they're in the dump trailer right now. And now I'm headed home so we can unload the chickens and set them up in their new location. All right, so we got the chicken tractor home, we got the dump trailer home, and now we have to unload the chicken tractor off the dump trailer and then into this fenced in area, which is just right behind where the sheep just were. So the chickens are in place now. They're successfully moved back home and that's it. Filthy Jim hasn't attacked us at all. He's over here. All right, stay tuned for tomorrow's episode for the exciting news.